Thanks. So, you know, after that wonderful introduction you gave me and, uh, you know, how wonderful and how what a friend you are uh, that I am to you, you give me this talk. Like, I've, uh, and I thought the cisplatinotopa side was a tough one. This is, um, so basically, um, whatever, what Jack said. So, <laughs> um, I was actually going to say, thank God I'm not that poor side. <laughs> yeah. You know, I, I don't think I have a, a, a slide that's different from either of those two guys. Let's see. Oh, yeah, one of these. Um, oh, we've seen that. Well, actually, we'll go back for just one. Uh, and, and again, just pointing out that the median survival, no difference. And um, just remember to think back on uh, the various clinical trials that we've talked about, not involving an EGFR tyrosine kinase inhibitor. So if you take that out, um, and you were asked um, to evaluate a new regimen that had a benefit in response and a benefit in progression-free survival, but no difference in overall survival, um, which would you favor? Uh, and I think that the issue is we, we really, uh, one could actually argue that a drug might not actually be approved um, in that particular setting without showing um, improvement in overall survival. Believe me, I'm stretching. I'm sorry, but I have to, I have to say something. Here's I-PASS. My orange light is on already. Um, and uh, we've seen that. No difference in overall survival in the I-PASS study, as you've heard uh, a couple of times. And no difference in survival whether or not they have the mutation or uh, whether they don't have the mutation. Just uh, showing the median. Uh, Lux lung, this is uh, with a fat nib. Again, uh, comparing to cisplatin otoposide, showing a, a doubling of the progression free survival in terms of the median, uh, a nearly a doubling from 7 to 11. Hazard ratio 0.58, no difference in overall survival. So the summary <laughs> is basically you've got um, an agent that does work exceptionally well, but as long as they get the drug, it does not matter whether they get it first, maintenance, or um, as second-line therapy. The only issue is that you have to be darn certain that they do receive it. Um, and there really isn't anything else that I can say otherwise. Um, so thanks. <laughs>